Scott, thanks for coming. Lots of great things going on with Silver Spring. You know, you've been in this space now for a while and uh, I think really gotten a great, uh, great example of someone who's been there since the beginning and now really enjoying some of that success. You know. We, well, we, we certainly, the company started in, as you know, in 2002 and right. we took off and really started to make some traction in 04, 05, 06. Yep. We, we, we got a lot of good companies behind us. Uh, it's been an exciting time. Yeah. There's, there's, a, there's so much opportunity in the yeah. smart grid space. Um, and then firms like Foundation Capital, who you right. know are yeah. here this week, sure. and huge fans of yours and what you've done at this conference. Yeah. So we were just delighted to be part of it. So, yeah, great example of perseverance and, and success. You know, just maybe some lessons for the other entrepreneurs who are in a similar situation. You know, when I moved from the previous career, I'd been at uh, EDS and Pro Systems yeah. for about 20 years. Great career, yeah. It was a big decision to move across. Yeah. And I moved across because I had a lot of confidence in the people that were behind this company. Right. Um, Adam Grosser and Warren Weiss right. and the Raj Vaswani and Eric yeah. Dr And you really felt like their handshake was as good as Absolutely. any commitment to a real strategic plan. Yeah. And that proved to be even more important than I thought it was yeah. in 2004. Because in 2005, we had some tough times. It was yeah. early. The utilities, as you know, are somewhat risk adverse. True, true. The sales process is Takes somewhat a while. long. Yeah. And, but we all hung in there together. Yeah. And after some very tough times in, at the end of 04 and 05 and early 06, we got a big breakthrough. Absolutely. We got one very thought leading utility to sign on with us, deployed our technology, loved it, Fantastic. it worked well. And then the snowball and the, effect. And then it became a bit of a, yeah. it adds on, right? And yeah. the utility industry, does an awesome job of learning from each other. Right, right. And it's the... And everyone it, wants to be first to be second. Ev it, it, it is a lot like that. Yeah. But you know, every utility now that we sign on is at the help of the previous utility sure. and all the current clients, but we also do something unique for them. Yeah. They all want a slight different implementation that's unique to their company, unique to their service territory, sure. unique to their customers. And so it keeps making our company better, and then it gives back to the original customers right. that help launch our company, but it does take uh, a big commitment from the people that want to step up and sign up. And, uh, We're called long-term investors. Yeah. They're long-term investors. Long-term outlook here. And uh, that's one thing, great thing about the Silicon Valley is the innovation, the commitment to launch great companies that certainly you've done a fantastic job at that. And uh, it's been great to be part of it. So prognosticate for us. What, what do you see? You know, you've been in the space for now a while. What do you see ahead in the, next, in the coming years that's different? You know, what should we expect? Well, I, I think that uh, we're in the first inning. It might, in sure. fact, it might still be batting practice. That's I right. was telling some people today. Good point. Everybody's like, hey, you guys have made some good progress. And I said, it's so early. Absolutely. This is such a big industry. Yeah. Not only have we just started the real impact of clean technology, energy efficiency uh, in the United States, but other countries outside of the United States might yeah. be further ahead in other alternative energy. Absolutely. But I think the United States is really leading the charge in smart grid technology. Mm -hmm. And so we've just scratched the surface. I think the future is really unlimited when you think about the, the largest industry on the planet. Tackling the 21st century economy. Tackling the 21st century economy. Right, bringing right. technology has been proven in other industries to, to this challenge and this Absolutely. opportunity. I think it's uh, just, it, it, I can't imagine a place I'd rather be.